What is up guys, this is Nick. We are back and today we are going to be continuing our Archer. So we have a few more episodes in this to go and then we will be all done with this uh, this bad boy. But let's go ahead and hop into skills real quick before we fight the boss. So Elemental Strike, one that I do use a little bit but not too much. So I am not going to pick that one up. I'm not going to pick up any of the kicks. I don't really use those all that much what i do want to pick up because i do use the skill as long as it's not too expensive 10 skill points isn't bad i'm gonna go ahead and pick this up and this is the flow so i'll show you guys it's this and then it's up which is really nice i actually really like it pretty decent skill actually pretty good pretty good I, I like it it's not crazy but i do use that skill a little bit from time to time so i thought it's it, it's decent to pick up at least um shower of arrows i'm gonna go ahead and pick this one up i don't use it a ton but it's cheap enough and i i, I like it for single target which the boss will be and so that's why I wanted to pick that skill up. So we're down to 45. We had 64 when we started. And I think it's expensive, but I think that uh, the Earth Splitter, I think this skill is worth picking it up for. It's a high damage. I really do like it. Hello? Skills? There we go. I think it, it, it's good enough. And so I think I'm going to spend the 26 on that. And then I think I'm going to spend the 41 on Flurry of Arrows. Those are the ones that I use the most, so those are the ones I'm going to pick up. So, it's this skill, which I really like. Um, I probably don't use it as much as I should, but I do really like the skill. Let's go ahead and start this boss fight. I uh, have a couple of things planned for this video. Um, there'll probably be a cut after this boss fight. We'll get to something a little bit more entertaining. We'll start it off with our new skill that we just unlocked. And away we go. Use that skill. Count. I do really like that the archer is so easy to keep your distance and get in for quick attacks. Bounce out. Just great movement. I like. I, I don't want to make it sound like I don't like the archer. I just don't think he's gonna make like rotation of regular guys that I use. I guess is how I is how I have to put it. And it's it's definitely not about him. It's more just about that he just doesn't fit. I just don't like him more than my sorceress. It's it's like the only issue. That's like the only thing is that I just don't quite like him more than my sorceress. I really do like him, just not more than the sword. Okay, so now we have to go to the castle and take care of all of that stuff. And so I'm going to go ahead and run off and take care of that. That is over here. That's with all the harpies and stuff. And so I'm going to clean that up, and I will catch you guys in a little bit in the next area after the castle. Uh, and we can continue and have a little bit more fun. But I did get uh, the meteor dive, so that's like... That, like, makes me kind of sad that I spent my things, because now I have to wait, because I, I do use Meteor Cry a decent amount. Meteor Cry, Meteor Dive a decent amount, which we can get. So that'll be the next thing that I truly get, but uh, I will catch you guys in a moment um, in the different area than here. All right, I guess it's time for boss fight number two. Um, I hate the Karudos, so I didn't want to show that, because... I just don't enjoy this part of the game against the Karudos, but I did decide that, you know what, we can show the boss fight, because what the heck, why not? So let's do this. I'm going to gather this while the game is loading in here. All right, let's do this. While our little buddy here is... I don't know what he's doing, but I will take full advantage if you're going to let me line up stuff like that. Low game? There we go. My dude was straight just standing there. Yep. Create that distance. Oh, okay. You know what? I actually see the viability now. Get in here. Get that combo off. 
and then get out of there. Just dash back. Okay, not what I wanted to have happen. Get up, get up, get up, get up. Create the distance. It's all about got. It's all about creating that distance. And we're backed off again. Keep backing it up. Now I'm gonna dash to the side. There we go. Okay, that's not bad. The let's see here. This this skill left left trigger and holding back. I really like that skill. It helps you create like the necessary distance that you need in order to to not like <laughs> to not get destroyed as the archer. Because really, your only option close up is this thing, which is not bad. I, I will say it's not that bad. Or this. Those are like your two main close quarter options. And so it's nice to be able to create that distance. So I need to keep that in mind going forward. But yeah, I'll catch you guys in a moment. We'll be, we'll do something else. Probably kill, we'll probably kill mobs, not a boss next. But yeah, I'll see you guys in a second. All right. So I guess this is just a boss fight episode because now we're going to fight the, the bee tree or the bree tree guard tower. So here we go. Because I don't like the ancient tree ruins farming. So, once again, I didn't want to show that. Because I rushed through it as quickly as possible. We did hit level 40. So, that's cool. But, yeah. Time to fight the guard tower here. See, I wonder if, like, hitting it in the middle there does more damage. Oh, no. Let's try it. This is one of the easier bosses in the game, not gonna lie. This is like the easiest. Apart from like Red Nose, this thing is like a joke. It's like too easy. Could probably just sit here and hit it with that attack. Oh, oh, I got hit. Oh my gosh, that does some damage. This guy ever got hit by that thing before. What did my character just shoot at? It looked like he shot back there. What am I do doing? Oh, and then, then it's down. It's that, that boss fight is just... I don't. I, that boss fight is the big question mark. I just wish it was a little bit better of a boss fight. I feel like they could have made that boss fight a, a hair better, and it wouldn't be remarkably, rememberably not good. I, I think that's all it would take. It's close. It's close to being something good, but it just doesn't attack enough. That you just essentially just stand there and spam it with attacks, and ooh, it's dead. I like the con the concept of the boss. It's not the greatest execution of the boss. Okay, so once again, I'm going to cut away. And hopefully when we come back, I can do something that's not a boss. But who knows? Maybe I'll just warp this episode into a boss episode. And we'll just have fun slaughtering all the bosses. Wow, that gave me 60% XP. Really, 61 XP for 61% of level 40. That is, that is ridiculous. But all right, I will see you guys in a second. Alright, so let's go ahead and do the next boss. So this is the Dim Tree Spirit Bot. Boss, I guess I guess this is just turned into the five boss episode. I'll do one more boss in the video and we'll call it a day. Because, I mean, at this point we might as well have some fun, kill some bosses. And then have that be the video. We're level 45 already, which is a tad bit insane, if you ask me. I have not messed with skills, so... We will do that after this. I thought he died right there. I was like, uh, hello? Easiest boss fight ever? Woo, I dodged out of there. Toss that at him. I love that attack so much. Why did it do that attack? Not what I wanted to do. 
This thing is so big, like, there's zero chance of hitting me. Oh, then I da- okay, and then I dashed into an attack. I had- I just had to talk. I mean, look at the poor- look at the poor thing, it can't even- can't even catch me. Line it up. What's he doing? Hey buddy, what are you doing? Dash around. Get up behind him. Guess I'll hit him with this. Mix in a little bit more skills. Oh, I missed that attack. Okay, we're about- Oh, he knocked me down with that? I was just gonna do this attack with him. Oh, look, you can just dodge behind him with this. Oh my gosh. Oh, he can hit you with that. Okay, let's, let's not fight him like that. This dude is some tanky. This dude is tanky. Was not expecting him to be this tanky. Look at this. This dude, this dude has some tank to him. I'm actually kind of shocked. There we go. There he goes. There goes the big boy down. What is the... What's the next area? I don't even remember what the next area is. We'll go ahead and complete this. And that should get us... Gets us to 46. So let's take a look at our skills now. I have 106 skill points, which is pretty darn good. And we unlock some awakening stuff. So that's awesome. I use that skill a lot. I don't use that one as much anymore. I should start using that one. That looks like a fun skill, but I don't use it. Um, I kind of use that one. I really use that one. So I'm this one's cheap. I'm gonna pick that one up, and this one's cheap. I'm gonna pick that one up. Ooh, I'm gonna pick both of them up. So that that uses up half. So we'll use up half on the awakening and half on the regular. Um, eh, don't use that much. Don't use that much. Let's see. I don't need to get more of that. I do use this a lot, so I think it's probably smart to pick this up. It is kind of expensive at 16, but I think it's worth it. And then I definitely use that a fair amount, so I think that's worth it. That leaves us with 24. Could do the Fury of Arrow again, but nope. We got to pick this up. I love this attack. So that leaves us with just 9, and I'm going to go ahead and hold off from getting any more of that. So I think we go to Munch. Do we go to... Actually, I have no idea where we go now. We're going to head over here, and then maybe it's... I don't know what boss is next. I'm not even going to try to pretend to know what boss is next, but uh, I'll see you guys in a hot second, and we will kill the next boss so that we can... We can, we shall progress with the uh, with the next boss. And then next video, I promise, I will have something that's, that's not bosses, but it's just kind of lined up. This is kind of a boring part of the game to kill enemies, and so it kind of lined up well to just do bosses here. So, yeah, I'll catch you guys in a second. Alrighty guys, let's wrap this up. We are here to kill Cube, the boss of the Catfishmen. So we are level 50 now and take a little peek. I finally got a Layla's Petal. So you guys know what that means. In tomorrow's video, we'll have getting the fairy on a My Sorceress. So that should be cool. And I'm really happy that I was able to get it. Um, that was a nightmare. And so... I was worried it would take me a while. I mean, clearly, I leveled this character from, like, level 28 to 50 in order to get one. I literally just got it. Like, like literally, on my way to kill Big Boy here, that's when I got it. I also picked up a plus 15, um, plus 15 crossbow. Everything else is pretty much dead right now in terms of different items that you can acquire for the archer his offhand secondary as well as the awakened bow are all very oh my gosh he got absolutely destroyed uh they're all kind of uh expensive or non-existent there are none of these ragons up on the auction so not much you can do about that but we're sitting at 91 ap 78 dp with 
pretty much no money spent on anything except the plus 15 as well crossbow and yeah we've got a bunch of this stuff saved up uh let's see let me switch this up here i've got 47 of these 20 thousands and uh 17 of these 100 thousand so we got 1.7 million right there so not, not bad at all uh, as well as uh, I did go ahead and throw up the black stones and stuff that we had been getting from this. And we got a fair amount of money. Um, I also got a plus 7 Jubray Talisman from farming, which that was amazing. But pretty much, and you can see my uh, plus 12 as well crossbow sold, sold already. So I was able to get a decent amount of the money back uh, that we would ha we had to spend to get the plus 15. The plus 15 was about 24, 000, 24 million, and you could see that uh, the plus 12 was 10 million, uh, but it was a massive AP upgrade, and that's why I went ahead and did it. Uh, but that's going to do it for this video, guys. In the next one, I promise it will not just be bar boss farming. I'll have something more fun for you guys. Uh, so drop the video a like if you did. I don't think I've ever seen this big fish before. That's kind of awesome. Look at him. That is sick. That dude is awesome. Okay, but that, that's going to do it for this video. I can't climb up here, and I'll catch you guys later. Peace.